Hi, I am Leslie Lincoln, president of Software Savvy. We provide computer training in the Microsoft Office applications, such as Excel, OneNote, Outlook, Word, and PowerPoint. And we come to you. We are based in the Orlando area, but can provide training anywhere in Florida. Today, I have a tip for you in Excel. Excel has many different count functions. I would like to show you three of them. Which one you use would depend on the type of data you have. Let's go to Excel. What I would like to find out in this example is how many products I have in stock. Well, if I just count my products, it's going to include the ones that are out of stock. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a count function that counts only the numbers. So I'm going to count the numbers in this column. So that will tell me how many products I have in store. So down here, I am going to do a count function. Equal sign, count, open parentheses. Now I'm going to highlight all of the numbers that I want it to count close my parentheses and hit enter. And you can see it only counted the numbers. Now if I want to count cells that have anything at all in them, text, numbers, anything, then I would use another count function and that one is called count A. It has the letter A beside it. A is, stands for anything because it will count any cell that has text, numbers, formulas, anything at all in it. So I'm going to open up my parentheses, highlight all my products, close parentheses, and hit enter. It has counted up all the products that I have in that list. There's another count function that you can use. We're going to go over here to sheet two. I have a list of names and email addresses. Sometimes you might want to know how many email addresses are missing. How many blank cells do we have in this list? When you have a small list like this, it's easy to eyeball it and check, but think about if you had a list of thousands and you wanted to find out how many you were missing. In that case, you would use another count function called count blank, equal sign count blank, and open parentheses. Now I highlight all the information I want it to check, close my parentheses. When I hit enter, it will tell me how many blanks I have in that list. So these are three very helpful count functions in Excel. I hope you can utilize these different count functions. If you want to learn more, give us a call at 407-880-8447 to schedule a training session at your office. We work with large or small groups as well as individuals. And also, please visit our website for our tip of the month. I hope you'll find them helpful.